All right, this is gonna be a ROM review. This is a ROM, uh, this is for the Droid 3, and it is called, hang on here guys, uh, Darkness Falls or Darkness Rises. I'm not really sure which based on the form I'm looking at, but really neat. Um, let me kind of get into what's involved in this thing. Um, so we're gonna go first into settings and about phone. And we can see that this is a jelly bean, or jelly bean, I'm sorry guys, ice cream sandwich ROM. It is Android version 4.0.4. .4. And again, it's running on the Droid 3, and it's also AOKP uh, is your source for this thing. Um, now, this is not the stock launcher that it comes with. I've gone ahead and replaced it with Apex Launcher. The stock launcher, what I found is when you get to like the end of it here, like this thing loops, but when you get to the end right here, where you'd be the end of your scroll, if you go, if you hit that end while you're scrolling, it'll crash. So, just kind of a pain. So, I got rid of the one that came with this uh, ROM and put in Apex Launcher. Um, now, you do have some pretty cool stuff here. It's all this red, um, you know, your red battery, your time, all these different things, your little uh, battery bar going across the top. Um, everything's themed in red. You can see your, your camera icon here has got a red on it. Your messaging has got red on it. Um, so the whole thing has got a red theme to it, which which is really the, the coolest part about the uh, ROM I, from what I can see. The other thing that's pretty neat is this right here. This will overclock your Droid 3. You can overclock it to stock to 1.1 gigahertz or 1.2 gigahertz. And you can see down at the bottom it tells you what the current gigahertz are, which is 1.0, which is just standard. So I like that little thing built into this. Is it's an app. Let's show you some other things you got. You have uh, Beats Audio Control. So you basically get Beats Audio on this thing. I, I really think that's pretty neat. Um, and then uh, Bluetooth settings here. That's a pretty good app right there. So other than that, um, the only other custom app I really see on here would be this Tweet Dark. It's Twitter, but it's darked out. Um, so that's that's I like that a lot. Uh, let me just show you some other things here. You got like your your call stuff here. Um, you can see that's themed as red, the little slider on the side. So let's see like a dialer. Here you can see the same thing. We're, we're themed up here on the top with reds. So uh, that's pretty neat. Let's see what else we can show you. Uh, text messages. Again, it's all red theme. So th that's what you got with it. You can see it is very smooth. Um, so the two the two real issues that I've seen with this thing playing with it is, or I should say three, is the stock launcher crashes, which is kind of rough, but you can just replace the launcher with something else you want, which is fine. Um, camera works. Video does not. Neither does panoramic. So um, that's kind of something else you want to keep in mind with this with this ROM. Also, for some reason, when you hit the microphone over here on the search bar, it crashes instead of using like Google Now. It just Google Now does not work on it. I don't know why. But you can search normally with the search bar. Just when you hit the mic thing, it crashes. Let me show you. See, it says retry. And it just crashes out. So, just doesn't work. Not sure if there's something you can change in settings to fix that. I haven't looked into it anymore. But, I mean, very, very smooth. You know, you got your AOKP uh, clock and some widgets for it that are AOKP. -OK um, your ROM controls here. Let me show you some other stuff in settings. So there's some pretty nice customization on this thing. It does have themes in it. You have ROM controls and you have stuff from start of tweak to performance. Signal battery percentage you can change in modification a lot of those things some toggles LED power save modes weathers uh, Navigation bar general G uh, IU stuff um, boot animations and disabling those kind of things enabling them uh, So it has basically all of your AOKP customization in it Which is really neat to play with and really customize it the way you like to have the phone running 
So I really do like that. I, I definitely like all that kind of stuff. Uh, pretty nice. So, you know, startup tweaks here. You got things like zip aligning, APKs, enable SD boost, which I normally have on. Yep, so we'll leave that on. Um, you know, fixed permissions, all those kind of things, all, all on startup. Let's see what other ones you got. ROM control. Um, you got performance. So you have your min max CPU speeds. Governors you can change. Uh, free memory settings. You know, some scrolling edge things like that. Um, so, like I said, this thing is very, very smooth. I do like that. You just basically got to replace the stock launcher. And, uh, like I said, camcorder not working. And the Google search button for speaking to it does not work. Other than that, really nice, guys. Really good ROM. Um, like it. Data is good. Wi-Fi solid. Um, and very customizable. So uh, give it a shot. See if you guys like it. And check it out. Again, this is the Droid 3. And we're running Darkness Rises or Falls. I'm not sure which one it is. Or maybe it's Darkness Falls and Rises. That sounds better. Um, so yeah, give it a shout out. Uh, check out here and see if you guys like it. Thanks. Uh, a little PS here for you. Um, also, this is installed on SafeStrap uh, 2.10, and it's the standard way of installing it with wiping your big three and flashing the the ROM. There is no uh, gaps that you need to flash with this. Everything in there is in there that you need. Um, if you want more gaps, you can just download them from the market. So. Uh, that's that's basically the situation with installing this thing. So thanks a lot